All right, guys, Shotty T here with another Lions video. I may make this a weekly staple because it is my favorite day of the week. Uh, it's not the favorite week that's been going on because we've been losing to this opponent. They're just machines, and it looks like I guess we must have had it easy last week, relatively speaking, because the the opponent that we lost to last week, they're actually down 5 to nothing in this matchup here, the Wildcats versus Kobe. So the Wildcats beat the team that we're facing this week. They beat them 13 to nothing. So, but this team, a Gladiator, actually no, they beat them nine to four. So they actually, so they put up a fight. Uh, so, and that's the reason why this opponent that we're facing has been relatively tough. But we're winning so far today. That's a good sign that we got 125,000 points, and I haven't even done anything yet. Uh, actually, let's see what's been done so far. Yeah, we've had a couple of folks kill it so far. But we got a lot of names I don't see yet that haven't popped up on the leaderboard. So we may have a chance to win today. But the opponent has, they are in France, so they're five hours ahead. So we can't, so a lot of them are already asleep right now. So we'll see what it looks like when I wake up in the morning. Uh, but I will be doing some of my point gathering today. But then in the morning... Um, of course, always a good reminder to double dip on the arms race. You got Hero Advancement, which is the experience points uh, production. That's going to be at 10 o'clock a.m. my time, Eastern. So for some of you guys, it might be a different time, time zone. But just use that period of time to use your experience points because that's where you're going to really gain a lot of points for today during that period so we will not be using experience points in this video but we will be using recruit tickets so we have 356 which is more than what i normally have i did uh take a plunge into the new champ this week which is um adam so that guy right there that you see right there so i did get him uh there will be some uh, shards I'll put into him to get me more of these um, milestone rewards here for Heroes Trials to get more little stuff here. I think I can probably get them to two stars at the most based off the shards I have. So I'll be able to get some little things there. But as usual, uh, the idea is to open up your tickets first before you use your shards because for every 50 one of these tickets you're going to get a legendary hero guaranteed if you already have that champ you'll get 10 shards uh so that'll be duplicates that way if you were planning on using generic shards towards your champ that'll be 10 less shards to use so that's why you want to go through these first before you go to your shards and keep in mind you don't have to go to 50 to get shards sometimes you might get random one shard or sometimes you might get lucky and get 10 shards before you get to the guaranteed 50. so with this amount of tickets today we're gonna have seven new champs or uh, uh, let's act like i don't have any champs at all to see how many new champs i get so this first batch of 10 should have a guaranteed legendary since we're at 45 out of 50. so let's see what we got here all right, so it's gonna be Marshall as the first one, which is good. I'm working on getting him to five stars, so the more Marshall, the better. So let's see what else we get here. And keep in mind, the purple and blue are just as good to get because you get, use those duplicate shards there uh, to get more points for the event. All right, so we got more of the blue. And of course, it's always good to get skill medals, which are also useful for today as well. All right, so the next guaranteed was Mark Murphy, which everyone should have, so that's nothing special there. All right, we got Kane and Cage, okay. So again, we'll take all the, the shards we can get from the purple and the blue. Uh, Richard there, and we're about to run into more guaranteed shards, so let's see, a guaranteed champ, I mean. And this time it's Carly, so again, nothing special there. I'm trying to see if there's any other champs that's coming to the game within the last month that are in this pool. So far, I haven't seen them yet. They may not be in here, or maybe I just got bad luck and not going to see them 
in this video there's some violet there's quite a bit of violet all right so we're about to approach another 50 on this next one here all right so murphy again so this hasn't been the most exciting batch like if i was a free-to-play player with all these tickets i was well, probably won't have this many tickets but if i had this amount of tickets i would be kind of disappointed at the the roll so far because pretty much all the people that have been pulled now there's a pull that wasn't a guaranteed pull or maybe it was i've lost track but all the none of these pulls that i've pulled so far are actual attackers i mean murphy marshall he's a support guy he has decent attack but he's not like tesla or kimberly or anything i think i had like one kimberly sighting but it was for like one shard um there's marshall again so it looks like it's the marshall it's the marshall show oh, there's another kimberly so we got two kimberleys we've got there's a dva for the first time um yeah it's not the most exciting but there's a kimberly finally a kimberly so um I might be able to get enough tickets to do one more. Oh, that, okay, I guess they saved the best for last. Just guess gave me a whole bunch of shards. There's some more Kimberly. Um, uh, that, yeah, that was another guaranteed. So I should have, I should be able to accumulate four more tickets today through train plunders um, so that way I can open up another batch of 10 before the day is out. Well, I'll be able to do that through the arms race guaranteed because opening up that get one ticket three tickets then six so i'll be able to open up some more tickets before the day is over but just as this is always a reminder and the tickets alone got me 1.3 um million so so that's why you want to kind of hoard as many as you can but of course the your bread and butter today are going to be your legendary hero shards so if that's going to be your bread and butter so you want to definitely do that and your experience points all right so uh the skill medals just to kind of remind everyone are these things here at the bottom where it says skills and you can increase your levels every every time you increase you gain some points there um also i think that's i think that should be everything there skill metal shards yeah so pretty straightforward day. So this is usually this is our biggest scoring day of the week. It's my biggest individual scoring day of the week. So because it's, it's less maintenance, but you got to keep in mind, prepare yourself for day five. So you want to start saving your radar tasks by now, if you haven't already. So that way, by the time day five hits at 10.05 Eastern, five minutes after you can unleash your radar tasks as well as start training your troops while we are getting prepared for server war. So it's going to be exciting. Going to have a couple a couple of videos talking about this in more detail. So be on the lookout for that over the next couple of days. My mini vacation will be ending tomorrow. So I will be on the road most of the day tomorrow. But I'll try to get a video in probably tomorrow evening or or Friday. Anyway, guys, uh, like, share, comment below, subscribe, and hope you hit that bell notification.